Hello everyone, uh, this video is thanks to uh, my buddy Jacob Rothenberg, uh, who I was I was just looking at YouTube and he uh, notified, it was the first time I got notified of this, oh, take these off, first time I got notified of this, of our ability to do A plus content through Amazon KDP, which is huge news. And he was very enthusiastic in his video. Uh, I'll link it somewhere below if you want to see it, but uh, just to give him uh, appropriate credit, maybe there was an email sent, but you know, you know what happens with emails, right? Like you see an email is just, you know, you get a bunch of emails and you don't read them and you just delete them and all that sort of stuff. Anyways, so Amazon uh, through Kindle Direct Publishing has given us the ability to uh, upload A plus content. So you might be thinking, Denny, what WTF is, is A plus content. Uh, a plus content is was originally open only for um, a select number of people. It was invite only, and Amazon in the background they do a whole bunch of testing where they uh, Facebook does this, Instagram, you know, a bunch of platforms do this, where they release only certain features to to certain people, and they test that out before they roll it out to uh, the wide population. So this was um, invite only. This was only for a certain amount of people. Uh, Amazon did the same thing with um, with their hardcover printing through KDP Print uh, hardcover books. They started it as a beta, um, although that was more open, uh, and then they opened that up to the to the masses eventually afterwards. So, anyways, enough vamping. What is A plus content, and what does it mean to us authors? All right, so let me give you an example of A plus content. So earlier today, I was looking up. I don't even know what they're called, like power banks or something, because mine broke at the USB port. Um, so yeah, so I can actually like charge my phone while I'm driving or out and about or walking. I mean, walking, I have to walk more often. <laughs> but anyway, when I'm out and about, right? Um, and you know, things opening up, I plan on being out and about more often, hopefully across my fingers. Um, so what, what anyway, what does A plus content mean? It's this stuff right here from the manufacturer, although I probably because KDP is not going to be from the manufacturer. So that's really not going to make much sense. Um, but if you look and I did a quick search and I couldn't find any authors that have this, but I know that there are some. Uh, but this is the A plus content, that extra stuff that you can add below it. Uh, now you can add um there might be like comparison tables or like showing off different features or benefits of of a certain book, um, adding these images. Now, some people might be thinking, is this going to actually make a difference in my sales or not? My gut says yes, um, but I always want to test. Uh, testing uh, to know something for sure if something is going to make a big if something is going to make a difference is to actually test. So that is what I plan on doing. Um, Tonight, I was sitting in my office here, just browsing. Actually, I was recording another video um, and uh, enjoying an adult beverage. And I saw this come up. I'm like, okay, I, I, I got I to get on this. So I'm going to do it. So first of all, how do you do it? So you go to your KDP dashboard here. You click on marketing. You scroll down and you have new A-plus content. Choose your marketplace. In this case, I'm going to choose Amazon.com. Manage my A plus content. <clears throat> uh, so you can go up here in the top right to start creating A plus content. And I'm pretending like I know I'm when I, knowing what I'm doing, but I just found out about this like 20 minutes ago. So I was just playing around with it. I was looking at adding the modules. Like I said, you can add the comparison chart. You can add uh, the images. You know, standard four images and text. Uh, then you have multiple images. Like it's really quite neat, actually. It's it's quite exciting. Oh, standard text. Look at this. This might be kind of neat too to add some extra sales copy. Yeah, that might be kind of neat. Anyways, <clears throat> what I was uh, planning on doing is doing this 600 by 180 image. And now I don't know what the actual rules and regulations are. I haven't even, like I said, I just found out about this like 20 minutes ago. I threw up Zoom or Loom, and um, like, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna record a video to to so my followers and my Facebook group members and my YouTube followers and my clients um, can can learn about this. Um, so standard company logo. Um, okay. So, anyways, I, I created an image just really quickly in uh, Canva. I love Canva. It's so quickly. I literally like just went to the other side of the room here, took a picture of myself. Um, 
and added a uh, added a review in there. Um, so this is for my Catch Unicorn book, Demystifying Book Marketing for Fiction Authors. Simple, doable, and the best guide I've ever seen yet for marketing your book, Amazon Reviewer. And that legit was from, from one of the reviewers. Um, so I want to add that. And again, I don't, some people might be watching this, you know, weeks into the future while we know more about this and being like, you know what, Denise, you are so dumb. Why would you add that? It is totally against Amazon's uh, terms of service and what you can add in the A plus content. But you know what? I am going to try. Um, so here it is here. <clears throat> this looks, I mean, I don't know if you could see it, but this looks a little like lower quality. And I even saved it in a PNG file or a ping file. Uh, describe image for customers using screen. I'm just going to put uh, image, uh, no, book image with the author. Is that going to be enough? Add. Yeah, it still doesn't look great in terms of like, it looks a little grainy, uh, even the text. I don't know if that's coming up on the screen or not. Um, that's all I'm going to add right now, although there's a bunch, like I don't want to get into copywriting and stuff, you know, especially you know, having some beers. Or in the military, it's called beers downrange. <laughs> They're really cheesy. But yeah, whenever I go here, and this is maybe, and I've, I've actually texted a couple of uh, other people that uh, are in the space that, would possibly be as equally as excited as, as me. But for some reason, I'm not able to actually apply it to any of the ASANs. Like it's not showing up like any of my books. Uh, because I can see the timeline here. I can click on the apply ASANs, but I can't click submit or anything like that. So if I go up here, it says review and submit. Just content name is required. Okay. Um, I don't know. That's unicorn. A plus content. Is that going to show up anything? It says search for ASANs, but there, like, there's no ASANs found. So I even typed in my ASAN here previously. Let me see if I can get it again. Um, yeah, it, it's not even showing up. Yeah. Ugh. Oh, what's going on here? Okay. Yeah, it's not even showing up. <clears throat> you know what? Maybe I'm just like too excited uh, that they just haven't figured out um, uh, the, um, they just haven't figured it out. You know, it's still a little bit buggy. I'm not sure, but uh, let me know uh, wherever I post this, wherever you see this, let me know, comment down below, leave a description, leave a comment, leave a whatever, leave a description. That doesn't make any sense. But leave a comment. Um, are you excited about this? Do you have anything in your mind uh, that you, you plan on doing with this? I'd uh, love to know. I My mind is going uh, a mile mile a minute, you know, a mile an hour, um, a mile a minute. Um, yeah, trying to figure out, you know, the best ways to do this. Uh, this is something I just came up with off the top of my head. I created this in probably two or three minutes. And I was just wanted to see if, you know, Amazon would accept this or not, you know my mug, like I'm, I'm wearing the same shirt and I was like that. I just really grabbed like a copy of my book and, and took a picture and uh, went to Canva. If you haven't used Canva before, like it's super, super handy. I have the Canva Pro or the professional or I don't know, the upgraded version. It's super handy. Anyways, enough about that. Comment down below uh, if you're going to use this. I'll probably do up a follow-up video um, you know, after I have a couple more ideas and maybe hopefully uh, some of the bugs are out of it. Uh, but yeah, this is a huge, huge thing for for us authors. Uh, it means an extra thing that we have to do on top of everything else. But um, it also means that there's an extra way for us to stand out and improve those conversion rates on our product pages, which is super, super um, helpful. All right. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, have a good night.